Hello everyone, my name is Kristen and I just got back from my trip to New York City. I've been home for less than a day and I already miss it. Um, so yeah, it's the day after we got back. We landed like late afternoon yesterday and today I am filming a what I got in New York haul because I did some damage while I was in the city. Before we dive into this, I just want to start off with a disclaimer that um, this trip was my senior gift because I just graduated from high school a couple of weeks ago and so this was what I chose to do for my gift. Um, all of the things that I bought, unless mentioned, I got with my own money, which was a mix of money that I've been saving up for the past year for this trip and graduation money that when I was gifted it, I was told, you know, just do whatever I wanted to do with it. So, um, I do not mean to brag or show off in any way, shape, or form. I just want to share with you guys what I got in the city. So, you know, if you're going soon, you can see, like, all the shops and stuff that they have and things available because I did get some specific New York stuff. So, I'm just going to dive right into this. Our first afternoon we were there, we got in maybe 3 or 4 p.m. that day, and our hotel was right next to Times Square, so naturally the first place that we went was the Disney store, of course. So um, when I purchased what I got, I needed a bag, and Disney is doing like a no plastic kind of thing. So this bag was $5. Of course, I wanted to get the one that said I Heart New York. Um, totally worth it though. I use reusable bags all the time, but what I actually got was something I've had my eye on for a while, and it is the New York City Spirit Jersey for Disney. So I have the Walt Disney World one, and I've decided I want to get the Spirit Jersey for like each park. It is a black Spirit Jersey. It has Mickey Mouse right here that says New York City, and on the back, it says New York, so I do have a specific New York merchandise item, and it has Mickey on it. All the better. Um, I got this in a medium, and it was $60. I went to the Forever 21, which is four stories and huge. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of stuff there. But that's right next to the Disney Store in Times Square, and I only got one thing from here. I got this necklace. Um, just this gold kind of layered necklace. This was the only thing I picked up there. Um, but it's really cute and I'm excited to wear it. The next day, my mom and I went to Top of the Rock. I got, of course, a pin. This is a Top of the Rock pin, which is very cute and it says, I've been to the top of New York. And they had this in different colors. I got in black and gold. But I just feel like it's very classy and like a classic New York pin. So the day that we actually went to Top of the Rock was the day that I did the most damage. It was kind of our shopping day because in the Rockefeller Center there is a Lululemon and I do have to say that my mom bought these leggings for me so thank you so much. But we do have a couple of Lululemon shops around us or stores kind of spread out there at Houston but none of them are that big and my mom and I discussed, like, you know, we're gonna go to one of the ones in New York and that she would get a pair of black leggings for me. Um, which these were the classic 98, but I did get to try on a couple of different styles in the black. So this is the Align Pant uh, 25 inches and they're very lightweight. I got these in a six. Um, and they're very comfortable from the time that I tried them on. I haven't worn them yet. But they're very soft and very like lightweight. The other ones I tried on were heavy, so I'm very excited to have a pair of black Lululemon leggings. Now I'm about to get into my splurge of the trip, but before I do that, so this is Free People. Um, the first thing that I got in there was this hair scarf. I actually wore it yesterday on the plane, and it's very cute. I've been wearing one of these for a while. It's just a scrunchie, then it's like a good like I don't know statement to go with like just a casual outfit or stuff like that and so I am love this so very much and my mom and I both really like the floral pattern it was like very spring summery and then this was my big purchase so I have been looking for this for a very long time and when I say very long time I mean months so this is actually a two-piece set which works out great because I can wear both of them together or by themselves so this is the top it's like an orange long sleeve light crop top 
or well I won't even say a crop top it comes down like right under my boobs but um, so this is the front and then apparently this is the back I tried the back on front and it was very you know but um, this is the top and then this is why I got it um, it is a maxi I think uh, orange flowy skirt I have been looking for an orange flowy skirt for the longest time so this was actually the last one in the store and it was my size who would have thought um so and I tried it on my mom and I both loved it so I had to get it and I'm gonna wear it all the time and I'm very excited for this the same afternoon we went to Soho which has a couple of shopping places and shopping places stores and they have an Alex and Annie store which are like these bracelets I'll show you in a second they're pretty well known for it and I have a couple of Disney ones so we went in there and I got a Harry Potter bracelet so I actually wore this a couple of days of the trip so this is a rose gold bracelet um, and it says we've all got both light and dark inside of us what matters is the part we choose to act on and I just loved the rose gold and I felt like I needed something Harry Potter and they had it um, so yeah I love Alex and Annie bracelets we went to Airy American Eagle in uh, Times Square and let me tell you, this was a steal. Uh, I got two items there. They equaled $100 together, 50 each, 60% off, $40. Then I had a $10 off coupon. I spent $30 on this. I saved $70. So I'm gonna show you what it is. So they had a Captain Marvel. They had a small Captain Marvel line. And so I picked up these geese this crew neck sweatshirt which is very comfortable I actually wore it one of the nights um, even though it still has a tag on it <laughs> it says actually I can then it has her logo here this is so very comfortable and cozy and I had my eye on it online for a while so my sweatshirt collection is growing but it's fine everything's fine then I got this dress it is perfect I feel like for summer and fall it's like this kind of tan gingham and it's got like a straight neckline with the ribbons to go around. I need to retie this. But yes, it's like a midi length and it's adorable and I'm so excited to wear this. Okay, then the next night I got candy from Dylan's Candy Bar. I already ate it so it'll be on the screen. I also did like a little taste test on my... Was it day five? I feel like it was day five of my vlogs. So whenever that comes out, watch it if you want to know like the candy I got, but I got that. <laughs> we went to the Harry Potter and the Cursed Child shop. They have that open throughout the day so you can look it up and find the hours. We did not go and see this play because it was very expensive because it's act one and act two, but act one is two out. It's, it's a thing. So. I knew I had to go to the shop though, so I first got this Gryffindor pin, because I'm a Gryffindor, I've taken the quiz way too many times, um, but these are the new logos that I'm not a big fan of the Cursed Child, but I do love the new logo, so I was like, sign me up. And then I finally have my Gryffindor scarf, and I can just Gryffindor it up with this but um so the pin badge was five dollars and this was 25 and tax is already included so if you're planning on going to the harry potter and the cursed child shop tax is already included my friend you don't have to worry about it so that was really cool i really hope that you guys enjoyed this haul video um i'm so happy with all these purchases and i'm so incredibly grateful that i got to go on this trip um it was all thanks to my mom. She planned it. We've been working on this for like the last 10 months and it was an absolutely amazing trip. We did not have like a single bad moment. Um, so I am very thankful that I got to go on this trip and I'm so happy with all of the things I purchased. Obviously because I purchased them. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching and still stay tuned for my vlogs. They are coming up. I think by now maybe the first two are up. 
but I have seven total, so um, definitely stay tuned for those every Saturday if you haven't been staying tuned already. Um, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video, and make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram. I am still most likely posting New York pictures, so if you would like to see that, you should totally follow me, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!